Mm -hmm. All right. Yes. And now I've moved into the garage. I have a Venetian garage and I've got shelves. Matter of fact, my pockets when I go home is to hang all the lights and get it. All right. All right. Hi, everyone. We are live here in uh, Thousand Oaks, California, and uh, people are starting to trickle in for this event. Um, bear with me here as I get my bearings uh, set here on camera and figuring out how to see the chats and things. Okay, James Lewis, I see your hello. Good to have you. Uh, we're going to walk out here in a minute and just show you the place. Here we are at uh, Paint with a Twist in Thousand Oaks. Um, it's going to be a cool, um, you know, venue here to just meet people, do a little painting with them, sign some books, that kind of thing. And, you know, what's really funny is that my <laughs> I'm getting so old that this is blurry to me. I can't read all these, the text coming in. Christy is out there. She should be joining us as well to moderate the chats. Sherry, hi. Good to see you. Cheryl. Um, Stephanie is there. Um, all right. So I'm kind of seeing your chats. Hi, Irene. Oh, my gosh. Hi. It's good to see you. All right. So um, we are going to uh, kind of zip around and just show you around the place here a little bit. Thank you very much on the congratulations. Uh, we do have people uh, starting to send us Instagram messages saying that they see our book on the shelves at their Barnes and Noble and places like that. So that's a really a trip for us because um, that's just crazy to us. It's, you know, it's not like a proud moment, but like so surreal. You know, who would ever have thought that? So um, let's go in here. Let me just kind of show you the main place here before we get started as people will trickle in. Uh, this is painting again, painting with a twist at Thousand Oaks. And you come in here and you bring all your buddies and stuff and they play music and then they have a, um, an artist that tells you what to paint and how to paint it and stuff. And uh, it's really, really pretty cool. So this is the main room here and we're gonna pan left a little bit and just show you some of the people that are here. Um, yep, there's Kim right there. There's, uh, there's some folks there. Hey, um, there's our snacks that we have going. And back in here, we have uh, the wine, um, wine and drinks and free popcorn and such like that. This is Mike, one of the owners here. And you guys may remember Angelica, right? From, um, we did a couple of shots or a couple of episodes at her place. Angelica, you want to say hi to everyone? We're live. All right. Yes. Thank you for coming. All right. Christy is here now. And we have some more. Uh, Friends dropping in. How are you? Good. good. Good to see you. Thank you for coming. We got cameras all over the place. Oh, what good fun here. Yes. You're a star. Oh. Yes. For our friends. Hey, how are you guys? Thank you all for, for coming. <laughs> no, we we're not drinking any wine here. We're uh, this is a working gig for us. So, so here are the books. And so we have had people again um, share with us that they're seeing our books, you know, in stores all around, and uh, it's really cool. Yeah, Aaron, if you leave uh, Oregon, I think you could probably make it in time, Aaron. Thanks for coming down. This is really fun. Um, again, you don't need to be an artist to come here. That's what's really cool about it is that they teach you just some basic things and like you can be drawing or uh, painting like this. This is gonna be cool. Now right there in black is Catherine. She is the owner here of Painting with the Twist. Painting with the Twist. So she'll be instructing later and kind of telling us all how to do things and stuff. And, uh, oh, Logan, you got your copy. That's great. Glad to hear it. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you again for your support on that. It's just exciting for us. And uh, these guys getting their copy here. So um, really cool. Yeah, order one up, Razor. That'd be cool, but all good. I'm going to ask him to something really quick here about how to make the chat show up in my phone here. 
Excuse me, guys. Sorry. Can you make it so the chat stays up? Um, I don't know how it, to do that. Yeah, you just have to scroll. Okay. Right. Sorry, guys. Okay, so Kim's giving me some schooling here. Um, oh, Carl, thank you for um, for that. We uh, we're glad that you enjoy the videos. Um, we really try to um, you know make them simple and fun, and we hope that you enjoy it. Missouri girl, you just got your book. That is really cool. Thank you. Thank you. Glad. And behind the camera today is a uh, longtime friend of mine, Dana. Um, he films for us sometimes when I'm actually in the videos. Uh, Irene, great. I'm glad that you did that. I actually sat down with the book for the first time as well and um, read the first four pages. And I was really impressed with uh, Kim's writing ability there. It's very nice. And... Okay, I'm gonna put you on the spot now. Rita drove up from San Diego to be here with us. So you're live right now. So that song you wanted to sing, this would be the type. <laughs> no way, you don't wanna hear me sing. <laughs> so tell everyone watching just real quickly what time you left this morning to get here on time. 3 a.m. You left here at 3 a.m. and traffic wasn't so bad till you kinda of got up here. Too bad. That's why I leave at 3 a.m. Traffic gets thicker when you get closer to LA. Yep. Ventura. And just real quickly, what are you growing and um, how has Kim helped you with your gardening? Oh my gosh, Kim's helped a ton. Um, she's local, so she knows all the local stuff. What to, what's successful and what isn't, and the very different varieties that she grows. There's a lot I grow. I listed would be here forever. <laughs> but um, the smart pots, she introduced me. She convinced me to use them, and I'm so glad I did. Great. So. Excellent, Rita. Thanks. We'll catch up with you later, probably when you're painting. All right, this right here is Catherine. I'm going to put you on the spot. <laughs> Catherine is the owner here of Painted with a Twist. Tell us a little bit about what okay. All right. Cool. Thanks a lot. And we're going to actually stay on and watch you do a little bit of that. And then we'll sign off after that in a little bit. Thanks, Catherine. All right. Cool. You got it. Thank you for having us. All right. Let me read some of the chats here. Hey, from PA. Great. Great to have you. Sorry, Armando. All right. Good. All right. <laughs> That's great. Hey, Garden of Sessions, good to see you. Thanks for being on. Sandra, thank you for being here, you guys. And let's see. Yes, um, because of this little event today, everything on our website is on sale, 15% off through tomorrow. Everything, seeds, anything else. Right, Kim? Yes, you have to use the code. Oh, yeah. Kelly Kim book launch or something like that. All right. All right, Chrissy has it in the chat. Very good. All right, so let me just show you around here a little bit more at some of the other people's paintings and stuff. So everyone coming uh, today will also receive some free seeds. <laughs> Sandra. <laughs> uh, that's great. Nice. And this is from yours truly, Kelly Kim Minas. And these are all um, paintings made by other people that have come through here. So very cool. Hey, Johnny, the promo code is... Oh, I got to ask Kim again. What was it again, Kim? The code? Um, Hang on a minute. Cali Kim Book Launch. Oh, shoot. Sorry. Okay, again. Cali Kim Book Launch. All right. Thank you. Okay, Christy just posted it. Thank you, Christy. All right, very good. We haven't seen Brandon rally yet. We hear that he's coming, so we're excited about that. Um, 
So, uh, good to see everybody here. I'm gonna give you just kind of a long shot here of the room and everything and just kind of let you see things. But um, you guys, this is so surreal for us to see our books appear in on the shelves and things. And um, again, it's not so much of a, you know, look at us, look at us. It's just surreal to see that and to have people actually go into a bookstore and look for it is just, it's just weird to us. Like, really? You know, that kind of thing. And uh, we're glad to hear that people are enjoying it. Uh, Brendan's about 25 minutes out. Just be safe. Um, I'm seeing some other chats come through. Got home. Okay. For the, you know. Oh, okay. So, uh, California Garden is here live with us. Thank you, man. Good to see you here. Kim is looking beautiful as well. Yeah, she is. <laughs> oh, sorry for the fingers over the lens. Sorry, you guys. I just don't have this live stream thing down like, like Kim does. She makes it look so easy. So, California Garden TV is headed this way. That'll be really cool. And let's just see who we have here. And you guys. <laughs> she's got her apron on and she's ready for painting. You guys remember Angelica? And tell us how your garden's going. What's going on? What are your challenges? All the. Great. And it all started on a windowsill for you, didn't it? Every, I have to start everything on a windowsill. I feel like it's like a rite of passage now. <laughs> <laughs> this is my dad. Hey. 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 Hey
So let's just take a look, see what's going on here. Um, crazy enough, right now we are sunny and warmer in LA right now. Um, but it's been really cold at night. Uh, all right, Jackie, you got it. We'll definitely keep you posted. And I definitely think we're going to do a lot more uh, meetups here in 2020. Definitely for sure. Plus, who doesn't love going to Chicago, right? When it's warm. So if anyone can help uh, the jackal about their yellowing leaves, I can't answer to that or speak to that. And Hicket Rita is getting her book signed. Look at this. That's awesome. <laughs> Sorry, Dana. All these cameras. All right. Garden of Sessions, Happy New Year's to you all too. I can't wait to see what you guys are doing on your channel with that um, box you're building outside the window because I can't build a thing. So Garden of Sessions, we'll be following you on your channel to see how that um, garden box comes along, you guys. Thanks for stopping in. I appreciate it. Jackie, you, you got copy number three. Wow, that's huge. Awesome. Thank you. Uh, Myrtle Beach. Let's see. Um, I, <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll we'll keep we'll keep in tune with you to see how that comes along. Sounds good. Mm. Rainbow. I don't know about planting an heirloom tomato. I I just film the stuff to be honest with you. All right, let's see. Very good, you guys. This is so fun. Thank you all for taking some time out here and joining us, Christian. Merry late Christmas to you as well. Really cool to see. This is so much fun. <laughs> so, Aaron, if you're still on, what about you and Laura? Will you guys be doing anything uh, coming south anytime soon? That would be really cool. Uh, good. Backyard, that sounds very nice. All right, very cool. So for those of you that joined in um, maybe late, this is Rita. She drove up from San Diego this morning uh, to be here. That is really, really neat. That's quite a trip. It's a good two to three hours, depending on traffic. So let's listen in here. Yes, Missouri girl, I totally am amazed at the whole book thing. Kim worked so hard on it. Um, hang on a minute. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I did. I will say that that uh, Kim worked so hard on the book, and it was not um, easy uh, throughout. There were periods where she felt like she couldn't finish. Um, it was just a tough time. It had its moments of, you know, of being really tough and writer's block, I think is what they call it. But Kim hung in there. She did great. Um, and the result book of the book was, is really nice. I got choked up and we actually have this on video when I, when we actually opened it up, our first hard copy, the author gets, you know, the first hard copy. And uh, we have this up in, from when we were at the Mandarin Festival. And it just hit me, just, I just, I was just lost for words um, when I saw the pictures and flipped through the pages and stuff. It's been really fun, and our publisher has asked for a part two. Can you believe that? They're already talking about sequels and all that stuff. So, all right, thank you guys for that. Let's see. Uh, yeah, if you have any questions, Chrissy, thanks for jumping in. Yeah, Sandra, I mean, the book tour kind of a thing. I mean, this is kind of like it. And I think what we're going to try and do is mix things in with other traveling plans and just try and coordinate it all into a couple of different events, you know, at one time kind of a thing. Meet and greets, book tours, you know, that type of thing. So, uh, well, thank you for that. Um, Kim hasn't decided yet as to whether 
that she'll do a bump tune just because it's like, woo, where do we go from here? But we do have some ideas already that we aren't going to share yet. But yeah, there is talk on that, so for sure. All right, let me just see what time it is. Hang on here a second, guys. Okay, I'm going to put you guys down and just kind of let you guys see the room here for a minute. So bear with me for some bumps. <laughs> okay, there we go. Okay. They are, yes. Come on, no. <laughs> All right, good. All right, I'm going to turn you guys over to Kim here for a minute. I know. Find out what we're doing. <laughs> well, there's a couple of different ways, Christian. You can get a book. You can order it right from our website. And you can now go to a brick and mortar bookstore, and they should be carrying it as well. I think um, Barnes and Noble for sure. Amazon has it. Um, Kim, is this book at Target? No. Okay, not at Target. Barnes and Noble is the only brick and mortar at this point, and then all the other links are on our website. Great. All right, good. All right, great, you guys. I think we're going to get started here soon, so give me a minute so I can figure out what's going on. Yeah, that's a good idea, Christian. Um, I think the publishers have a beat on that as far as how difficult that is to do or, you know, that whole thing. So we kind of just leave that part up to them. And we are going to be doing some nursery center stops um, here out in California, and we'll turn those into book signing events as well. So be on the lookout for that. And our publisher is working with us and those garden centers as to coordinating a date and time and that type of thing. Um, oh, Forest. Okay, yeah, I know exactly where that is. So, yeah, so that is in the making. So we do have a lot of that type of thing happening right now. Okay, so let me find out what we're going to do here and uh, see if I can give you back to Kim or something. All right. All right, Kim, you're on now, just so you know. So I'm going to take you around here into an adjoining room of Painting with a Twist and I'll show you around in here. This room is actually the kids' side and um, you can have, you know, a, a young person's painting party going on in here while the adults are in the other room, um, that type of thing. So uh, that's, this is kind of cool. It's a little bit quieter over here too. So here are some of the drawings that they did for um, part of their, their painting party kind of a thing. Really good. 
So, um, yeah, it's kind of weird to, to be on this alone. I could talk about cameras all day long and editing and that kind of thing. I don't really know much to say about the gardening, but we're going to start painting here in just a few moments. We're going to watch three minutes or so of that. Um, Kim is then going to come out and say goodbye to everyone and just say hi to everybody and that kind of thing. So um, that'll be kind of the, the wrap up of this here in the next 10 minutes or so. Um, so, well, thank you, Natalie. I appreciate that. I enjoy it, but um, there's only so much I can talk about for the gardening side of things. So, very nice stuff here. You only spend so much money on Love the rules here about for painting in here. All right, let's go back in and check in with Kim real quick. Let's see what's going on here. All right, where's Cap? Actually, I'm going to go over here. All right. So Catherine is going to step up here in a minute and start her painting. So I'm going to get this a little bit situated so it's going to get bumpy here for a second as I try and put the tripod down here, uh, guys. And then uh, Kim will step out into the back. There we go. Oh, okay. We got to get this. Yeah. Did you tell her about Malika already? I did. Oh, cool. Yeah. Tell her about you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You got a meeting every Oh, he didn't even realize it? That's cool. I'm a little overwhelmed by it. Yeah. Well, it's very special to have you here because you've been such an integral part of our channel and I've been able to be at your house and helping you plant your garden and everything and plus your pictures in the book. Yeah, thanks so much. So it's really special to have you here today with us. Okay, I got to show Yeah, let's let's see her, her page, her picture. This is actually Angelica's tomatoes right here. Did you know that, Angelica? Oh, yeah, my uh huh. Isn't that cool. <laughs> and then funny. your picture with you and your beautiful little daughter. And son. Wait a minute. Look it's here. Right here. And look right there. This what? Is the, this is the what? lady who said, "I have no clue what? to I'm growing veggies." Sorry, say that again. I was making. I said, "This jokes. is the lady who said, I have no clue to I'm growing veggies.'" And everybody gets to meet her live in person. It's so cool. Isn't that awesome? So, so proud of you. I was so stressed out about it. <laughs> you were. Yeah. yeah. Now it's just like, it's just fun. There's no stress. Yeah. And it hopefully helps you relieve stress and just Definitely. enjoy it with your kids. Yeah. I love getting my hands in the dirt now. Yeah. And just to be able to spend some time outside and then your kids can see it grow mm -hmm. and they're excited about it. Yeah. And and they have a little garden at their school, so I'm oh. hoping to get my hands on it too. <gasps> they do? I think you might have mentioned that to me. Mm -hmm. Very yeah, cool. It's actually a pretty good sized garden. It's all fenced off, and it looks like it hasn't had any love in a while. So. Need some loving. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. How oh, cool. I'm going to sign her book. Okay, sign the book, That'd and then fun. we got one minute until painting, folks. Woo woo! <laughs> yeah, Chrissy, she doesn't need to get used to that, huh? Signing your... People are saying you need to get used... Better get used to this. I guess I better get maybe a little quicker at it, but... Oh, that's great. All right, stick around. We're going to start painting here in a, in a minute. And I'm going to uh, keep broadcasting live that. And then uh, a few minutes in, uh, I'll give the camera over to Kim and she'll step over here into the quiet room and say a little couple of things to you guys. Um, I don't think we have the book available as an online format. Oh. 
Kim says that that might be coming. We're working on that one, of an online version here. Let me see if there's anything I missed. Uh, going back to you, Aaron, over with Garden Answer. Yeah, it would be cool for us to do a meetup. We definitely think that could be a fun event. Would you guys come see Garden Answer and Cali Kim in the same place at the same time? Let me know right now in the chat, okay? If that's something you would come to, to see Garden Answer and Cali Kim together on the same stage, whatever, chatting about garden stuff, if that's something you would come to, let me hear about that. Uh, yeah, the rubber said, that's what I was thinking too for that. So, okay, so we got some people chiming in here. Yes, they would come to this to see uh, Laura and Kim together. I think it would be dynamic. And um, here's what I'm gonna say about that. Keep an eye out. Keep an eye out on that because that's a dream of mine to pull something off like that. That would be a total blast. Plus her husband, Aaron, who is on the chat here, uh, he's the camera guy for um, her. And him and I are always talking cameras, lenses, troubleshooting and showing each other new equipment and stuff like that. So it's really, really fun. All right, so we're gonna get ready again here. We're gonna go live. And um, with the painting. All right, well, one more minute, everyone, and then we'll get started with the painting. So find your spot, and your instructor will come out. Yes, the book is on uh, Amazon, Donna. Yes, James, you would. All right, good to know. All right. All right, Catherine, whenever you're ready. So we're going to watch again a few minutes of Catherine doing her thing, and uh, then Kim will come out and say hello to y'all over here in, uh, in the side room. All right. You are on, Catherine. You are. Me too. Because of the local feds that I read it today. This is something local. I can understand what's going on. Not coming on. All right, if you're staying for the painting, grab your spot. Catherine is going to take the yeah, stage. Let's get this party started. Woo. Now, actually, I, I like small classes when I teach uh, the wood product. Oh, okay. Wood can I can see. Stuff like I can see doing Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, well, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, just you. I'm <laughs> uh, looking right at you. <laughs> well, welcome to Painting with a Twist. My name is Catherine, and I will be our artist this oh, okay. I am also the owner of this lovely little studio. So if you haven't noticed already, we're a two-room studio. This room is our 21 and above only room for obvious reasons, uh, because we are a licensed bar. Uh, the room next door is our all-ages room for uh, alcohol-free zone where we can entertain and in influence young artistic minds from the ages of 7 to 95. So earlier today we had a mommy class and this evening we have a family class in, in that room and after this class we're going to have a date night class. So it's, it's all day. So we just stagger them all day long. All right? Uh, who here has done something like this before? Painted. Oh, awesome. Awesome. So you're it. Fear not. You are in good hands. I am here to walk you through the process step by step. All right. Who here is actually saying wood? Stained wood. Oh, well, that counts. 100 years ago. <laughs> You graduated right before me? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, the technique that I'm going to be uh, showing you today, the reason why we don't have easels there, is because we're going to be working on an application that's kind of like staining wood, and then we're going to distress it, whitewash it, and that's what gives us this bow finish that you see here. So we're going to stain the wood, then give it the whitewash, and then we'll 
do our lettering and the different herbs. Okay, so, and you can do any herbs you want, but these are the herbs that were on this particular painting. So this is our rosemary, our cilantro, and our thyme. All right, good stuff, all my favorites. Smells so good. All right, so just to give you a little bit of history, painting with a twist were the inventors of the paint and sip industry. It all started uh, back in New Orleans from the aftermath of Hurricane Katrina as a way of giving. There were two women who were very involved in their, or those were their exact. I <laughs> started, Hurricane knocked us down, you know, so they're like, we gotta do something to turn those grounds upside down. Uh, and it did start out as a women getting together, giving their group hug and supporting each other through very, very difficult times because people lost lives, homes, businesses, basically needing to start all over again. So they decided, okay, we're gonna have a gathering. In the South, when you have a gathering, it involves three things. Uh-huh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gather. It involves three things. One, oh, lots of it, all right? And Southern women love their men feel lots of something. Two, uh, it's it's a gathering, it's a party, so it's a lively social affair. So there's music, dancing, laughing, food, giggling, and a boatload of gossip when you have women together. And three, specific to New Orleans, where the hurricane hit, um, it's tradition to have a very colorful theme to your party. Okay. Yeah, because it's so better sound if you just... Okay, sounds good. I'm going to give me the hot spot one second. Uh, hey guys, thanks so much for um, hanging out with here with us here today. Hi, Pat Sella. Thank you so much. I'm so glad that a lot of you have already received my book and are enjoying reading it already. What a great um, time we're having here today. So thank you so much for taking uh, time out of your Saturday. I'm just going to walk over here a little bit so I don't interrupt Catherine while she's speaking. So thanks for taking the time out of your Saturday to join us here. We're having a great time. Um, as you can see, they're starting the painting project and we'll be doing some more um, book signing after that's over. Hi, Irene, how are you? So it has been an absolute ball seeing the pictures that you all are posting, uh, the emails that you've sent um, on Instagram, Facebook, and, and emailing me. Uh, just how many of you have received the book it it totally is just so rewarding to um to see that people are receiving it and reading it and really guys i poured my heart into it so it's just such an, an amazing experience to see so many people actually enjoying it and it really makes me feel that much more connected to um a lot of the viewers and followers so thank you guys so much um i'm glad that you're enjoying the book signing hi uh, bob how are you uh, my backyard. Great to have you guys here. Irene, Brian's Jersey Garden. Thank you so much. You guys, I really appreciate all of your wonderful um, comments and I'm so glad that you're enjoying it. And hi, Christy, Everything Sunflowers, the moderator. Our moderator is here and what an amazing time um, that you're able to join me here for the live stream. So um, we could probably just answer a couple of questions here and then we're going to um, sign off the live stream and then go and join in the, the painting project. So if there's any questions or comments or anything like that, again, just want to tell you guys, um, thank you. Thank you so much, Donna. First book of many. Um, I'm just going to walk back here. What's that? Oh, sorry. It's a little quieter back here. In her, kind of back in the back room here with all the paint. See all that paint there? <laughs> Hi, Johnny. How are you? Thank you so much. I appreciate your congratulations. What a ball. It's just such an amazing day. Um, just everything that has brought us here to this point. And I never in my wildest dreams, when I started my little um, garden, uh, gosh, how many years ago is it? Eight or nine years ago in the corner of my backyard, never in my wildest dreams imagined that I would be here today um, sharing this day with you all, I'm kicking off the launch of my brand new book. And I really, my, my hope and my dream and my prayer is that it really helps encourage people, inspire people, motivate people to get their hands in the soil and discover the magic of gardening and discover the thrill of being able to say, I grew this. I'm a gardener now. So I would love it if you guys would email me or post on social media, either um, just let me know how the book encourages you, inspires you. Let me know your favorite part of the book, your favorite photograph. 
um, that's just so rewarding. It's it's motivating, rewarding, and inspiring to, to me and to Jerry to hear how you all are enjoying it and how it's encouraging you to grow more of your own vegetables. So if you have a chance, take a selfie, tag me with it. I would love to see a picture of you with my book or if you're in the bookstore at Barnes & Noble, we're gonna actually head over to a Barnes & Noble near here right after um, this event is over and see if they have it in their store yet. So that'll be a lot of fun too. So um, anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining us. Have a wonderful and safe new year. And we really appreciate you, you hanging out with us here today. And remember, we're not live streaming on Monday, which I think it's the 30th. We're taking a little break for the holidays, but we will be back to our regular Monday live streams on January 6th. So thanks a lot for joining me here today, guys. And make sure you drop me an email. Let me know your favorite part of the book. And maybe we'll go out here and take one more quick look around before we sign off. All right, so we'll just walk out here. Which has happened to these legumes on top of all the dog hair as well. And then uh, my pepper and um, but uh, if, uh, if I do have to warn you that some pigments do stain though. Uh, so all right, guys. Oh, Amy, I like what you're saying here. In the book, I love the story of how you began. I'm just going to sign off here in a second, Jerry. Mm -hmm. I always thought I had a black thumb, but you talk so much about trial and error and how it's okay to fail that you gave me the confidence to just go for it. Thank you so much, Amy. No black thumbs. Everyone has a green thumb in there somewhere. Well, Jerry's going to come on over here, and we are going to sign off. Thank you so much, you guys. We love you guys, and we're so very grateful um, that you helped us get to this day. Yep. All right. Bye, guys. Have a great weekend. We'll see you on January 6th on the live stream. All right, guys. Happy New Year. Okay. Bye-bye. Thanks for joining, everybody. Bye.